Oh my gosh, Ranting, it does look like a horror movie. There's so many people waiting for the sunrise. Hello guys, good morning, welcome back to another video. And as you can see, it's still pretty dark around me, right? And you may wonder why I'm up so early in the morning. Well, long story short, it's because I was scrolling on social media the other day and I saw a really, really gorgeous video of sunrise in Singapore. So I told my friend, like, what are the odds that we actually wake up early in the morning to watch the sunrise? And he was like, why not? And now I'm just walking to the Little India bus station to catch the earliest bus from here to Jalang Ulu Sembawang. I'll catch you guys in a bit. Oh, I don't know if the MRT starts running so early in the morning. Alright, I just met up with my friend Rentin. Thank you for always being up for like these spontaneous decisions. <laughs> How do you feel? Still sleepy? Actually, it's fine. I woke up like at 4.50 actually. <laughs> I don't know how. Well, like naturally? Yeah, like naturally though. Oh my gosh. <laughs> now. Have we ever seen Singapore at 5.30 in the morning? I've seen it three times already. <laughs> we just got up that 80, we need to transfer to our second bus which is 1.38. And according to the timetable, the first bus is going to be here at around 6.16. So we have around 10 minutes left. I'm really vibing with this nice little bus station here, to be honest. It is so quiet. And renting be using my shoulder to take photos. Like, I'm like a tripod. <laughs> oh wow. Cool. Alright, here comes 138. <sighs> We just got off the bus and now we just have to find the entrance of the park. Uh, apparently there are like several different ways where we can enter the park connector. So we're just trying to find the closest entrance to us. Oh yeah, I think we found it. Even though it looks... Oh my gosh. Even though it looks kind of sketchy, the entrance. Because there's no... Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh my... Can like, you even see that? Yeah, I don't think you guys can see anything from here. And where is that flashing light coming from? Oh my god. Oh my gosh, guys. It kind of reminds us of those horror movies. Because there's no light. There's really like no light. Total darkness. Oh my gosh, Renting. It does look like a horror movie. Now we're just walking towards the famous sunrise spot um, and on our way we actually ran into a lot of cyclists. Uh, I'm so surprised by like how early they woke up this morning because I think when we were still waiting for the bus we already saw some cyclists like on the road. Okay, it's getting brighter and brighter which is a good sign also a bad sign because we don't want to be late for the sunrise. Okay, I think we're here at the spot because there's so many people waiting. But it's not right here. <laughs> Glad that I'm wearing black shoes today. This shoe road is kind of muddy. But this is so nice. We made it on time for the sunrise. Hey. Where's the sun door? It's gonna come out. <laughs> A few moments later. Hmm, actually, is the sun gonna come out though? See, it seems pretty bright already. But it's a pretty cloudy day. There is a life I lead in this city Hurrying to cut my teeth 
Oh well, we didn't actually see the sunrise as we expected because the weather is pretty cloudy. Um, so it was kind of disappointing, like we were expecting to see those gorgeous colors coming from the sun, but it's a different vibe, right? <laughs> Please tell me it's worth it. Yeah, you know, it's the journey that matters, not the result. If you think about it. True though. Put me together, take me back where I belong. I want it all. You know people always say that life is fair, so if you don't get to see the sunrise, at least you can take a lot of great photos. Because um, you know, like the lighting is like perfect, it's so soft, ideal setting for photography. Um, I'm feeling very, very blessed right now, even though I was kind of sad that I didn't get to see the sunrise. Yo, look at my shoes. Uh. Okie dokie, just got done with the photo shoot. Um, and actually when we were doing the photo shoot just now, two ladies came up to us and asked if we can take some photos for them. Of course we did, right? Because we're nice people. Um, but then after that, they just suggested checking out a restaurant near the Spring Leaf MRT station because they have really good prata. Um, so I think we're just gonna go there and grab some breakfast because we are so hungry. Return from my spinning ball. I'm remembering the words you told me. You watch a squid game, right? Do you want some uh, spoilers? Do, do you want to know who survives? Oh! <laughs> Put me together, take me back where I belong. I want it all. I had a feeling, but the feeling is all gone. What are you gonna get? I wanna try this one, Blaster Blaster. It's kind of like a remake of Benedict. The food is here, so we got egg plus prata. And this one is their specialty, so basically it's prata with ham, poached steak, and sauce. And we also got two glasses of Milo. Milo. Classic choice. Passing by this fun house. Wow, where did they get all these? This is the bus we're supposed to take. And Google Maps, it says that the bus stop is supposed to be here, but we couldn't find it. Apparently, it's not here. And we have to walk all the way back. And then we missed the bus. Hello guys, welcome back. Uh, so I was planning to end today's vlog when we were leaving Sambal One, and then I realized, hold on, like I'm going to an exhibition with my friends this afternoon, which could be something interesting to vlog about, uh, which is the reason why I'm back here. Um, so I just finished my monthly psychological counseling session, uh, which was at Orchard, and my counselor just basically walked me through some visualization and meditation exercises, and to help me calm down, especially after a super stressful week. And then I took a bus from Orchard to Promenade, and then I kind of just like walk all the way to Barina Bay because uh, we're going to the Art Science Museum which is behind me. Hey. Hello. So I got a bundle for three exhibitions. Uh, I think I'm gonna check out Virtual Realms first. This is a new one. are generated by the sound waves. <laughs> Crazy, right? <laughs> Very on point. Thanks. 
So how do you want to represent music as a concept? I don't know. So the voice here are really diverse. Mm -hmm. So that's why I wanted this. Look at the artwork I created. I'm oh, gonna put my masterpiece here on the wall. Alright, so we just left the Art Science Museum. Now we're just gonna take the MRT to Farrell Park to get curry rice. Um, but I think I've shown you guys that place before in another video. So I'm probably not gonna vlog our dinner. Um, but per usual, thank you guys so, so much for following my channel. And please remember to give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so already. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.